Hello guys, this is Raven from DG Integrity. Welcome to Tech News Episode 2. Qualcomm launches their first 5G modem Snapdragon X65 that will deliver an insane 10 GB 5G speeds to Android flagship. This modem will release later this year and this modem comes with MMware antenna module that delivers a better coverage and uses AI to boost their connectivity. Snapdragon X65 will make its way to Android flagship mobiles launching in the later of 2021 and 2022. It also announced a more affordable version of Snapdragon X65 is X62. Zoom Studio is coming up with the predefined filters in their latest version. You can add some mustache and beard kind of filters so that it will even up with your boring meetings. Xiaomi is going to announce the Redmi Note 10 series in India by tomorrow. It gonna be a competitor for Realme X7 series. Redmi K40 series to be launched on February 25th and it comes with 120Hz AMOLED display and a processor of Snapdragon 888 SoC. And it has 5000mAh battery with 108MP quad rear camera and up to 12GB of RAM. MI and Redmi smartphone will be having the new MI UI 12.5 update. This update gonna release from quarter to 2021 flagship mobiles of MI 11 and you will get this update in previous mobiles like MI 10 series and MI 9 series as well. In this new update, you can uninstall all the applications except some core applications. Xiaomi launches MI TV Q 175 inches 4K Q LED Smart TV with 120Hz refresh rate. It comes with processor Quad Core MediaTek MT9611 processor. It has a RAM of 2GB and a 32GB storage and OS is Android 10. MI Voice Reboot supports Google Assistant and Amazon Alexa. It comes with 30W 2-15W speakers. It cost up to 1299 euros. It will be approximately 1,14,500 Indian rupees. Realme Ray certified on Tena with Snapdragon 888 SoC and it comes with 12GB RAM, 120W fast charging, single punch hole AMOLED display with 120Hz high refresh rate. Google's next Android OS, Android 12, is going to launch later this year. They release some of the first look images on the internet. They have worked completely on their UI. There are a lot of UI changes comparing to older version. They are bringing a lot of changes in their privacy settings. They are testing this privacy chip for almost two years now. Privacy settings contains toggles to disable the camera and mute the microphone entirely. You can disable all the sensors on your device by using sensor off. The National Highway Authorities of India told that from 5th 15th, fast tag is mandatory for all the cars across India. Fitbit app now lets users to track their blood sugar levels. We have to manually log in their data, includes blood glucose and related symptoms. It will import your blood glucose level from OneTouch Reveal app, which data got feeded through OneTouch Glucometer. Thanks for watching this video. Please kindly support my channel by giving a like, share, and subscribe. And follow DJ Integrity on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook.